On the job for only three weeks, Pinellas Deputy Austin Callis is off the job tonight after a Snapchat post went viral making light of nearly shooting someone. The Pinellas County Sheriff saying that kind of sentiment is reprehensible. Peter Bernard is on the night beat for us in Largo tonight. Peter. Good evening there, Jen. It's not been a good week for the Pinellas County Sheriff's Office. Earlier this week, a corporal resigned, and just today, a probationary deputy is off the job for comments he made about almost shooting someone. This is the Snapchat posting that started it all. Sitting in his Mustang, Deputy Austin Callis wrote, nothing like almost shooting someone to set your head right, LOL. God I gate should be hate. People with knives. The sheriff tells me the firing isn't about social media. It's about the words used. And you don't need to be a deputy sheriff. You don't need to be a law enforcement officer. You don't need to be out there protecting people when you're making comments about shooting somebody to make you feel better. This comes the same week Corporal Sean Pappas resigned after investigators found racist, sexist, and pornographic pictures and videos on his cell phone. And it's happening as the sheriff's office tries to get released from a federal consent decree about minority hiring. There's a couple of things in there that are very troubling, uh, but not the least of which is the LOL are laughing out loud at the end. You know, that to me is telling. I stopped by former Deputy Callis' Gulfport home. Nobody answered the door. A yellow Mustang with a sheriff decal sat in the driveway. Callis responded Sunday to a report of an armed person in Dunedin. William Kane at the home, shown the posting, wonders what could have happened. Well, I think it's wrong, like I said. And knowing what she had, it's sad that Kelly might have got shot over nothing. Over nothing. And it's important to note there was no knife. And the sheriff tells me Callis offered no explanation at all as to why he posted what he did. Jen? You know, and it's interesting to me, Peter, because it seems like it's not what was posted on Snapchat and shared that really is bothersome. The sheriff seems more concerned about this former deputy's state of mind. Yeah, it's the message for sure. And just to be clear, that deputy was on his own for three weeks. He was hired back in November. So the sheriff is happy he caught it now instead of, say, three years from now. And as a probationary employee, it's easier to fire him. Peter Bernard on the night before us tonight. Thank you, Peter.